what's up guys it's Nadri from NDHD and I'm back here with another video so here today's video is probably on Redmi Note 4 camera versus LE2 camera so without any much talks let's get right into the video and one more thing before proceeding to the video I would like to declare the winners for the giveaway so the giveaway winner for the Lectomania Bluetooth speaker that is a $5 one where I have shown that it's a small tiny piece of shit which is probably good bad which is up to you you have to try it out on your own anyways so Swavik Sarkar is the winner for the giveaway so I definitely congratulate him for his gift so I will be sending his gift this week or maybe tomorrow or maybe any day but he will get this gift on this way so anyways guys let's head into the video and let's see who wins the battle So first of all let's start with the close range focus shot. So before that let me tell you that the photos which appear on the left is LE2 and to the right we have Redmi Note 4. So as you can see that the shot on the left with LE2 is more detailed, less noise and even it's clearer than Redmi Note 4 which troubles literally on close range focus shots. And now. If you go to the second pic which is taken with the landscape mode from both the phones you can literally see that the colors are more vibrant but there is a little loss of details, little just a tiny bit you can say. I think this is due to its color vibrancy and little addition in contrast. Although it makes up the image more beautiful than LE2. So as for my sake I am going to go for Redmi Note 4 in this pic. Now if we move on to the third pick which is it's a little shadowish place I have taken the pick so where both the phones takes up a good detailed pictures but this test is for focus in dark places and Redmi Note 4 on the right has more clearer picture than LE2 which is a bit distorted or hazy you can say but naturalness of the pick goes for LE2 as in Redmi Note 4 as little bit bluish in touch to the image. So if the round goes for LE2 then it's a loss where for naturalness it's a win for LE2 or vice versa you can say. So coming to the fourth picture you can definitely see that the pictures are taken place in a dark situations where the details are lost in Redmi Note 4 but it's clearer in LE2. But if you go for the details again then you can go with LE2 which has a good contrast in the background than the Redmi Note 4. But the frame is little or slightly noisy in Redmi Note 4. So you can say that the LE2 wins this round. And again if you note that in this pic the photos are differently as only I have faced the walls with lightning condition. So if you have any problem regarding it you can definitely inbox in comment section. The selfie cameras on this phone are quite impressive. But here LE2 has clearer image with the brightness where Redmi Note is little bit dimmer but details are intact. Now it's the time to switch over to another mode. So now I have taken these photos from the portrait mode of both the phones. But as for the pics you can either go through natural photos of LE2 which is neat, clean, detailed, not oversaturated as Redmi Note 4 which is due to its oversaturation the lips color has changes from green to yellowish green. Anyways that's up to you which photos your eyes prepare. So that's up to your opinion so which photos you decide or the which camera you decide to choose. Again to the next pick the LE2 has natural images with no overexposures making the image as natural as it could be. Even you can see the clouds are being captured detailedly but as for Redmi Note 4 the clouds are overexposed so there is low details in the background or you can see just a white patch on the blue sky. So here Redmi Note 4 loses from LE2. Ok guys now it's the deciding factor up to which phone or the camera section you choose or which phone you decide to buy based on the camera. So here's my review on the best camera reviews on this phone or a comparison video you can say. So guys it's up to you I have this is all my choices my picks. I have chosen to show so if you have any opinion or anything against me you can definitely comment down in the comment section and I will definitely try to clear it out and yes you are always welcome to put your own opinion like this topic. So guys it's not you from NDSD just signing out till then keep calm and peace out.